So clean to the panels. Perfection is going to be the getting the 360 bars with Titan Whip. After a two-year hiatus, the most anticipated event of the year is back and better than ever. We were lucky enough to spend a whole week watching the greatest riders on the planet do what they do best. For all the gold and glory, the results were nothing short of explosive. This is Crankworks Whistler. The birthplace of Crankworks in 2004, Whistler has evolved into the mecca of the mountain bike world. There are several highlight reel events, but none is bigger than the Red Bull Joyride. Since its inception, the progression in riding and video quality is staggering, but one thing has remained the same. These athletes are pushing the limit every year. Week one of Crankworks is all about the Enduro World Series, which we missed this year, but we're jumping headfirst into all the events of week two, starting with the dual slalom. This event puts riders head to head as they race for fastest time down the track. Roost after roost, Joey having to eat burger dust in these burbs. Joey inside corner, is he gonna get the rails? He needs to one more, and no, disaster. Joey Foresta misses the last two games. So put your hands together for your specialized dual slalom champion, pivot rider, Bernard Kerr! In between major events, there are also several Kids Works races. We stopped by the BMX Challenge to watch these shredders rip it up. Whistler is full of talent of all ages. We stopped by the dirt jumps later on to watch a jump-filled jam session. The vote from the crowd was unanimous. Whistler kids are just built different. Evenings are capped off with an event in the park. <laughs> So thankful for everyone involved. We couldn't have done it without them for sure. I'm assuming the easiest place for everybody to see this is going to be on social media later on. Oh yeah, it'll be on the YouTube. <laughs> Day two was all about the pump track challenge. Generally involving some turns in the track, this year was a straight sprint to the finish line, which made for tight races. Put it 
Johnson though. Away, but this qualifying position is second. All to play for. There we go. Game drops. Looking like Keegan Wright. The fastest qualifier. There we go, game drop, even start from all four of our competitors. Marilyn Buchanan with a bit of a jump, Keelani Hines and Jordy Scott absolutely neck and neck as they come across the line, surging, Carolyn Buchanan taking the win and the gold medal, Jordy Scott dropping into the silver medal position, Jeff Ryder, Michaela Ashkova here. There we go. Whistler, get behind it. It's your gold medal match for Rams Pro. Make some noise. A dead even heat. One, two, three, four. James Fleming looking like he's got the advantage. But they're coming across the line. Well, we are seeing Adrian Laurel with the win. Luca Coletti in second. Jaden Fleming with the bronze medal. And Joey Barresta in fourth. The French runner. He wasn't As the days went on, more tents popped up in the village and the crowds got larger. One of our favorite events to watch was speed and style. Riders are challenged to outrace and out trick their opponent in this head to head format. Right now, Whistler, we gotta make some noise. Come to the final jump. Top back foot, no hander versus the back foot. We gotta make some noise. Let's bring him into that final jump. Back foot to back foot. 90 on the first jump. The whip off challenge is simple. Throw your bike as sideways as possible, then bring it back for a smooth landing. And finally, the main event most of us are here to see, the Red Bull Joyride. Riders have been practicing all week to hone in their skills for the competition. With 38,000 fans here, these guys are ready to unleash their biggest tricks. So without further ado, sit back and enjoy the show.
coming in. Two double effort. Lines up nice high. Yaka make it happen. Wonderful touch. Step down. Just one more event left this week. Grab your Red Bull and head up the mountain to watch the Canadian downhill event. This is a full-on race of who can make it down the techie, unforgiving, steep trail the fastest. One wrong move can cost these riders the race.